In this video, we will discuss about medicinal plant Atropa belladonna. This is also commonly called as belladonna. Belongs to family Solanaceae. Basically, this uh, plant is also called as a deadly nightshade because this is a poisonous plant. This is native to parts of Asia and Europe. Uh, this is herbaceous, mean uh, somewhat green, soft in color. We can see this plant. And this also shows branches. Height of the plant may go up to 2 meters or 7 feet. And shape of the leaf is ovate. So this is ovate shape. We can see these are the leaves. Then plant bears flowers. These are its sepals and these are petals. And shape of the flower is bell shape. So this is also called as uh, campanulate bell shape flowers. We can see the color of the flower is purple. And this also has green markings on it and its fruits uh, when this ripens up this form fruit fruit is almost uh, called as berry and this is black in color subglobular in shape and inside fruit are present many seeds so this is about morphology of atropa belladonna if we see its chemical constituents and this is called medicinal plant so this is rich in drugs which is made up of alkaloids about 0.3 to 0.6 percent alkaloids are present alkaloids are hyoscyamine and atropin leaf and root are used to make medicines in italy this is a practice uh, to enlarge the eyes Ballad balladona means beautiful lady so this is a risky practice in italy uh, we can see here this is the eye part and we can see this part this is the pupil this is enlarged with the help of this atropa belladonna and eyes look beautiful so in italy this practice is used belladonna berry juices i mean it's fruit juice was used historically in italy to enlarge the pupils of women giving them a striking appearance because which people enlarge and eyes will become beautiful and this will give a striking appearance a pupil is the part this part of the eye which admits and regulates flow of light to the retina so this controls the inflow of light so uh, because this plant is poisonous also uh, one has to be very careful we, we cannot use the plant as such ourselves we, we can uh, only do it with the help of doctor or physician or with uh, doses which have been researched and made possible in a medicinal point of view so what are its medicinal uses? Uh, plants can be used in appropriate doses as part of regular medicinal practices as well as uh, many homeopathic doctors also use in homeopathic practice. Plant contain uh, basically two chemicals which are used for medical purposes scopolamine and atropine. First we'll discuss what are the uses of scopolamine. Uh, this is used for reducing body discharges. Even uh, if acidic uh, acids are being produced in the stomach or nausea, acid reflex. So this is uh, done with the help of scopolamine. It also controls the heart rate. And this is used for relaxing the muscles. So when muscles get tightened up or they become stiff. So they, this can relax the muscles. So this is also used as muscle relaxant. Atropin is used to dilate the eyes like pupil is enlarged and striking appearance to the eyes. Optometrist doctors which deal with the eyes often used to help dilate people when examining a person's eyes and when person's eyes are being examined for eye problems and then also its pupil can be enlarged by using the atropin. It can also be used as an antidote to insect poison if insect has bite, uh, insect bite has occurred to a person and that insect bite has certain poison in it. To nil that poison or to nullify the effect of that poison, we can use the atropin as an antidote. So this is also used in uh, chemical warfare agent. Chemical warfare agent are chemical substances that have a direct toxic effect on plants, animals and human beings. Like uh, we have seen uh, nowadays uh, biological warfare, coronavirus. You don't have to go to the war. You can just release the coronavirus and so many people are affected. Similarly, chemical warfare, we can uh, release the chemicals which will affect all the living beings on the earth. So this is called as chemical warfare agent. Other uses are, uh, this is used to treat motion sickness. Like if you are traveling in a car or in a, any other vehicle and you may get sick, you may vomit. 
So this is used to treat that uh, motion sickness. Irritable bowel syndrome, if you are not passing the stool properly, uh, your irritable bowel is there, irritable stool is there, so that can be treated. Stomach lining can uh, get converted into sores, right, stomach ulcers. So uh, that, that may be painful, so it is being again treated with it. Excessive nighttime urination, रात को बहुत ज़्यादा urine pass करना पड़ता है. Parkinson disease basically is a mental problem, central nervous system problem. Uh, fatigue है, depression है या आपको uh, dementia type हो रहा है या और कोई behavioral changes है, तो वो भी treat हो सकता है. Uh, pink eye, your eye become pink in color because white part get inflamed, so that become pink in color, so that is pink eye. Common cold, fever, बुखार हो जाना, वो pink eye. Uh, respiratory infection है whooping cough which is contagious meaning एक दूसरे से भी हो जाती है hay fever seasonal जैसे pollen grain allergy या कोई और allergy हो रही है season की वजह से so this is called as hay fever so this is used to treat hay fever also side effects of uh, this are on body's nervous system like uh, dry mouth mouth में become dry pupil enlarge हो जाते हैं या दिखाई अच्छे से नहीं देता है blurred vision स्किन जो है ड्राई ड्राई रहती है उसके ऊपर रेड रैशेस हो गए फीवर रहता है फास्ट हार्ट बीट रहती है हेलुसिनेशंस आपको जैसे लगता है कि आप वर्चुअल वर्ल्ड में हैं सेंस ऐसे लगता है बट रियल नहीं होते हैं सो दे आर क्रिएटेड बाय योर माइंड सो दीज आर कॉल्ड एज हेलुसिनेशन स्पाजम आपके मसल्स की जो प्रॉब्लम्स हैं स्टिफ हो गए हैं या पेन हो रहा है मेंटल प्रॉब्लम दिमाग की प्रॉब्लम्स कोमा आप जैसे कोई होश ही नहीं है आपको एंड यू आर लाइंग एज सच विदाउट एनी सेंसेस सो दिस इज आल्सो नॉट सेफ फॉर प्रेग्नेंट वुमेन एंड ब्रेस्ट फीडिंग वुमेन सो बिफोर यूजिंग दिस प्लांट एज मेडिसिन वी हैव टू कंसल्ट डॉक्टर और फिजिशियन और अदर हेल्थ केयर प्रोफेशनल वी कैन नॉट यूज डायरेक्टली प्लांट एज सच और इन वेन रिसर्च इज डन फॉर मेकिंग द मेडिसिन So it has to be tested many times. So that can be used directly. You cannot use the plant as such. So this is all about Atropa belladonna, which is a medicinal plant which has many values as medicine. Thank you for watching my video. If you like my video, please like, share, and subscribe.